What up, guys? Coming at you with another video. On top of that, another challenge. Diecast Review Racing put out a challenge, I guess, a week ago, maybe. And uh, the challenge is pick some cars that you would like to own in real life. So I don't know how many cars you can pick. So I'm coming up with at least nine to 10 cars, but I will narrow it down to my maybe five, top five cars that I would like to have in my, if I actually own them. So let's get this challenge going. So guys, I will put a, a link in the description to his channel so you guys can check it out and show him some love. So let's start it like this. So wheel on. I think like this is my number nine car. I think I would have a cougar. I like cougars. I got, I am so sorry. I'm not, again, I'm not working where I normally do my videos at. So it makes it kind of awkward. <laughs> kind of trying to move some stuff around, so it's kind of messy. So this would be my number nine car. Uh, I remember I told you guys a story about this car that, that I wanted to buy one, the guy didn't want to sell it to me, which was all cool. But I still like these cars. Okay, so that is number nine. Just trying to get them all up here, guys. I'm missing one. There it is. All right. So the next one to the party will be this Road Runner. Because I like my muscle car. It'd be Road Runner. I mean, I like the challenges. I would like to own one. That would, that would have been one to add. But I would have to go find it. <laughs> so that's an honorable mention. I do like the challenges. And you can't beat a muscle car. It's just all to it. They don't build them like this no more. So that would be number eight, guys. Number seven, Mustang. I think these some badass cars, especially now. But I like the older ones. Those, those were cards. You could beat those cards to death, and they would still run fine. Not a whole lot of extra stuff on it. If it break down, you can just pull it in your yard and fix it, and be back on the road in less than a day. Now. You got to take it to the shop, put it on the computer. So, so that's number seven, guys. 
Number six is a Camaro. I also like the Chevelle. Love those. Let's see if we can get you a little bit more center. I don't know if that's going to help, but. So hopefully you guys enjoy this challenge and show him some support, you know. Because I've been, I've been out of the loop, been busy. So I'm trying to catch up on everything, try to catch up on watching videos. I try to watch as many as I can. All right. My number five, so these are my top five. Dodge Charger. I always did like the Charger. I love those cars. It's just pure power. The Charger and that Challenger. Uh, sweet cars. So pretty much, guys, I'm showing you nothing but some some muscle. It's just, it's just all about the power. Sorry about that, guys. Another one of the favorite Pontiac GTO. Old school. And a friend of mine had one when he was growing up. He used to race it. All black. Wow. All right, so my next one is my number three car. And this might be a shock to some of you guys. But it's not a shock to me. I like these big old monsters. The super bird. I like, I've seen one of those in actual real life. I was surprised. But yeah, I would like to own one of these. That big old wing. Nice car. So guys, we're making it down to my final two. Okay, let's just spin one more time. All right. Number two. Chevy Nova. I think these were cool cards back in the days. I think they're still cool cards now. You can find one.
So guys, so far you've seen my top eight, well, eight cars. I showed you my top four. So it's obvious what the top five would include without even thinking about it. So the whole thing is hopefully you guys do this challenge and have some fun. You know how we do it. We have fun doing challenges. But they make you think at the same time. So I just really sit back and think about what cars I would actually want to own in real life. So my number one is probably will always be my number one. Is the Nomad. I definitely would like to own one of those. I don't know what it is about it, but I think these are cool cars, cool wagons. Would I get it flamed out? If I could, yeah. Wouldn't that be awesome seeing something rolling down the street, Nomad all flamed out? That would be cool. So guys, that is my answer to the challenge. Hopefully you put out a challenge and show him some support. Until the next video or the next challenge, you guys, as always, like, comment, subscribe, share. If you're new to this channel, please become part of our little family here. Leave a comment. Check out our friends in the comment section. They are some great guys, knowledgeable guys. And as always, guys, I thank you for taking the time to watch my videos. Because without you guys, I'd just be making videos for myself. And I'd be sharing my. <laughs> no, but thank you guys for the, the time you take to watch them. All right, guys, I am out of here. No more babbling. You guys have fun. Keep hunting now. Bye now.